What is the best sounding wireless headphone available today? Well, that's a tough question to answer, but at least Bose is saying this is it, the Soundlink Around Ear Wireless Headphone 2. Bose did have an earlier Around Ear wireless headphone, the AE2W, which had a somewhat awkward looking Bluetooth dongle attached to it, but as you can see, there are no dongles with this model. Everything is integrated, and the headphone comes in black or white for $279.99. As you might expect from a Bose headphone, it is a very comfortable fit and a relatively lightweight design with plush memory foam equipped ear cups. The controls are integrated into the right ear cup and easy to operate by feel. The headphone folds flat to fit in its included carrying case, which has a pocket to store the USB charging cable and a headphone cable to use in case the battery dies and you want to listen to the headphones in wired mode. That cable doesn't have an integrated microphone, but the headphone does. It has dual mics in fact, and it works well as a wireless headset for making calls. Battery life is rated for 15 hours, which is quite decent. It has a quick charge mode that gives you two hours of battery life with just 15 minutes of charging. Like I said, it's pretty hard to definitively declare a best sounding wireless headphone because everybody's ears and audio tastes are different. But what I will say is that this is one of the best sounding Bluetooth headphones currently available. The sound is clean and well balanced with ample but not overpowering bass. You're not going to get that little bit of extra crispness and sparkle that you get from a really good pair of wired headphones, but Bose tends to focus on delivering smooth, pleasant sound, and these certainly fit that sound profile. The company's Soundlink on-ear Bluetooth headphone also sounds good, but you get slightly fuller, more open sound with this model. For those waiting for Bose to do an active noise-canceling wireless headphone, this isn't it but at least you get a decent amount of passive noise isolation from the around the ear design. I'm David Carnot from CNET.com. Thanks for watching.